Hey Fluffies, welcome back to Pink Stylist Plays. Today we're continuing our playthrough of Layers of Fear 2. So apologies for leaving the last chapter off on such a cliffhanger, but I don't know, there's no real good stopping points for this. It's like one continuous story, so let's jump back in and see where it goes. Here we go. Okay. It's all very quiet and ominous. The last chapter we were... There was such a really complex puzzles that we were solving, but there's not really been any more to the story as such. We, I still think it's two kids stumbled aboard this ship thinking it was like a pirate ship as part of a game and somehow died in maybe an accident. We don't know yet. And their ghost is haunting this ship that's currently running a production crew type thing where they're filming a movie. I don't know. Let's keep going. Oh! Wait. This got very modern very fast. <gasps> Look! The door's gone completely. Look. Look at you! It's alien! Oh, I bloody knew it when I saw the doors locking! Oh, right, that's something freaking wonderful about this game. Hang on. Fucking, when I saw the doors, I knew it. Like, there've been, there's little flecks of movies, like movie trivia, dotted here and there. We had The Shining as well. I love that. Okay. Oh, I don't know where to go now. It says just enough so that it doesn't, you know, be naughty and actually say the movie. Oh, can I take something? Oh! Don't swept me, you goose. How rude. Can I see anything else? I love that. Oh, hang on, what's this? Nothing. Okay. <laughs> Blimey. Oh. You. Okie dokie. I really thought something was going to jump out then. <laughs> Thank you for not doing that. <laughs> oh crap. Oh damn it, we're going vents. There's been a lot of chasing in this game and I don't want to do any more chasing, please. Oh god. I think we're going to outrun a face hugger now. Wait, which way do I go? What is this? Oh! Well, something just ran away. That looked very face huggery to me. Oh, hold on. There's more ways to go. No! Hold on. Weird. Okay. I don't know, I don't want to miss anything because there are a lot of easter eggs in this game. I've managed to find quite a few so far. Yeah, hang on, before I go in there, I'm going back in there. Sorry, but there was a corner I didn't take and I'm going to take it. Let's go this way. Hello, easter egg. Nice. And also gross. That's that door! Oh! There's a lot of doors you can only get half open. It's weird. Okay. I'm trying to collect as much stuff as I can because you kind of fill up the cabin and... Okay. Um, like Layers of Fear 1, things you collected and choices you made change the outcome of the game. I don't know if that's the same in this game. And who is singing? Oh, hang on. Okay, there is a world outside of our own, hidden beyond a veil of black mist, where ancient beings dwell, immortal, everlasting. They move among us unseen, unless they wish to be, unless they choose you, a mortal to play their cruel charades, a plaything to be toyed with and discarded when they cease to amuse. Do not listen. 
do not play their game. The price is far too high. Beware, you of great talent, of great skill. Beware, you who have seen their true faces. For you, only madness and death. Sometimes something is left behind. Objects, terrifying in form, puzzling in function. Fear them as well, for they are a manifestation of their wicked presence. Lovely. Oh, I collected something. Hang on. Why can I turn on all the taps? I'm not going to leave him running, am I? I'm sure there's an achievement for that, but I just can't. I hear singing. I'm going to find out where it's coming from. It's coming from here. Wait. It's here somewhere. I can't find it. Is there anything I'm meant to be collecting with that voice? It's annoying. No, I guess not. No, I can't find it. I guess there's not anything to collect? That's going to really irritate me, but okay. Do I go in there or in... That's where I came, so I guess we're going back this way then. Wee. Sorry about that. I just really wanted to know what like, I was missing. So that's... Wait. Oh no, that took me out the other side. Okay, so that's fine. Okay, shortcut. Brilliant. Which I kind of went really like a long way out of my way to get to. So it wasn't really a shortcut, but that's fine. Oh good, we're not in the like, bowels of the ship anymore. Fabulous. So it shouldn't be as spooky. Hello. Come on, do something spooky then. You know you wanna. Oh look, blowy rat. Hello. You fuckers! I could have done without that, thank you. Oh, fucking... oh, I love when they do that! That's so annoyingly clever, but at the same time, freaky as fluff. Okay. Oh, it's all changed now. Oh, wait, can I just... Would you mind if I just take this, please? Uh, involved in a number of personal scandals, sparking moral outrage and rumours as to the thespian's mental health. Uh, our sources within the household reveal that the star would spend hours on end behind locked doors. Voices could be heard at times accompanied by laughter or crying, but then the door would open, revealing there was no one else in the room. Still, as the famed critic Noah Wensley is quick to remind us, extraordinary artists seldom lead ordinary lives. We must not forget the great art carries a heavy cost. To lose oneself in a role sometimes lead to losing oneself, period. Oh dear. Oh! Oh, this looks nice. It's like a tea party. Can I join? Oh! Can I join? Oh, I mean... I'll join, but not if it involves that. Thank you. I have standards. Oh, are you covering your face now? Were you doing that before? You know what? It's fine. Deary me. Uh, let's go. None of this weeping angelness, please. This is totally Alice in Wonderland they're doing now. Looks oh. like the rats got to it before us. What? What was that? Shh. We're not alone here. Are they trying to say the ship was haunted before even the kids got on the boat? Is that a hand? <gasps> Hello? Knock knock? Oh, it's locked. Well, that's a bloody good job, really, isn't it? That sounded lovely. Oh. Oh. Oh, look. What is this? Sorry I touched your box, but it's important to me. Oh, God! Ugh. Oh, it stinks. But it looks like someone took a bite. Ugh. Or something. Come, let's not wait for it to come back. Oh, 
Oh, please don't make me duck down anymore. Someone tells me I'm going to be outrunning something in a minute. Oh, oh. Had to reinforce some of the cages. Something's got the animals all spooked. Might be they sense the storm coming. Need to batten down the hatches. It's going to be a big one. All right. Oh. <gasps> Hello. Please don't tell me these mannequins are like shadows of real people. Like ghosts of what used to be here. Oh, number three. Yay. It's really easy to miss these. I'm hoping I haven't missed anything so far. Okay. Oh. <gasps> Hi. Hello. Hello. So did a doggy take a bite of this gross steak? Oh look. I love that the mannequins move like 10 frames a second. Look. No. Which way do I go? Well, light turned on, but I don't know where. Oh. Dog training and delivery. Okay. Cage and contents delivered to the live cargo deck. Kept feeding to a minimum as instructed. Handle with caution. That doesn't say anything about petting them. Can I go this way or is that... Okay. Doggies need pets. I'm going to take a wild guess and say I'm going to be outrunning doggos soon. Uh, okay, up we go. Looks like that's what happened then. <sighs> Doggo cage. Uh. Oh! Hello! Okay. I'm trying to look anywhere, but oh, hello. Anywhere but actually at the game. Oh, wait. No, no, wait, wait. Before I get in there, hang on. Okay, maybe I'll get in there then. That's fine. Oh, I stopped it. Did it do anything? Locked. Locked. Oh! Shit! Fucker! Alright, fine. Dickhead. Oh, not dead. Okay. Oh! Hello? Can I help you? That's totally fine. Can I get past you? No, you're just gonna block the way. That's fine. A bit rude, but that's fine. Can I go in there? Spooky. Can I get going? Nope, dead end. Totally fine with me. Let's go. I think they've moved. Ugh. Nope, they haven't. That's good. Oh, hello. Let's just close that. There you go. Flashlight. So more ship repair, which I'm really not qualified to do. Oh fuck, it's the fucking spooky fucking fuck. Oh, you fuck. Why? The little chasey bits are really annoying. Cowards die many times before their deaths. Thanks. I, I know the hunt. Literally, these the, oh, chasey bits are out of nowhere. Well, now I know it's there, so I'm just going to go, wee, hello. Do I have to trigger it, or can I go just straight down there? Ooh, it's a glowy chalice. I want a glowy chalice. No, but so does a dummy, which is not a dummy. Will it trigger it still if I go this way, or is that cheating? 
Oh, look, there's a path there. I have to go near it. I have to get to the chalice. So if I go there and it triggers. Oh! Oh! Fuck! You dickhead. Okay, so touching the monster, also not a good thing. Death is a fearful thing. Fine. So what am I doing wrong then? Can I go this way? I cannot. Okay. Um. Any ideas? What if I can just go like that and then can I trigger it and run? I don't want to. <laughs> Wait, hang on, let me just check down here just in case. Because if there's a shortcut, I'll take that. Piss. There is not. Oh crap. Well, that's open now. That wasn't there before. Look, there's <gasps> something there. Oh shit. Oh look. Huh. Where's it gone? Did I outrun it? Kinda. The chalice is gone though. I really wanted that as an apple on the floor. Whew. Another apple. Another apple. Am I chasing apples now? Oh! Over there. Can't you see it? <sighs> Look. Whoa! No. This isn't what I saw. You have to believe me. We're out on the edge of the world, Mr. Hardy. Nothing is as it seems. I'm trying to figure out what character in this eats a lot of apples, because there's a lot of apples been dotted around this game so far. Especially in the last chapter. Rotten and gross and this and this. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh look, hello. Apple, apple. Up we go. There's at least nothing's chasing us. Silver lining. Wait, hold on. Oh look, hello, huh? That's clever. Wait. Hold on, stop it. There it is. I'll piss off. Hang on, hang on. Look, look, door. No door. Hang on. Door, no door. That's so naughty. I love it. So, no door. Door, go. Oh, I like that. <laughs> this game is really clever. Oh. Wait, is there anything here yet? Oh, hang on. Uh, top of the page, turn off. Mr. Hardy wouldn't get far without his beloved Captain Baines. The captain is the main character of the story. Some people call him the Black Wanderer because of the colour of his ship's sails. Captain Baines is strong and fearless and he always gets the treasure in the end. Mr. Hardy is a bit envious of the captain because he would like to be as strong as him. Hmm. I don't know if their siblings turned on each other or what, but it's starting to look that way. Ooh, thank you for that. Piss off. They like putting that painting everywhere, don't they? Oh, hang on, I don't know where to go now because there's like just two places in there. Nope. Maybe not, I thought I saw something. I guess I didn't. Down we go. Is that... Are they... <gasps> what? what is happening? Why are they floating? What the... Okay. That's totally normal. Come on, 
keep this shit together. What is going on? <gasps> is that a flamey coffin? It was. Oh dear. Oh, hello. Are you okay? Now for you a sandwich. Oh, he's gone. So they were carrying a corpse on board. Oh, and it's locked. Thank fuck for that. Um, so there was another ghost on board then. Playing the kids? I don't know. Yeesh. The plot thickens. I would like to come back to the top of the boat now. Oh, scary corridors. This isn't going to be pleasant. Jump scare imminent. It's going to happen. Let's go with full. I did it. I'm missing or am I trapped here? Oh no, hello. Ha ha ha. Always makes you second guess yourself this game, adding new doors and stuff. Alright. Let's go! Whew. Wanna go to the top of the ship? So we go right down. That's totally fine. This one's empty too. We need to keep looking. Lily, I mean, Captain, there's something out there. In the dark. Hush now. Stay behind me. I won't let anything happen to you. Okay. Oh my god, they're both ends! Oh! Oh, well, I'm gonna die, aren't I? If there's. Oh, fuck me sideways. They're coming from all angles. Run, run. Ouch, that hurts. Run, ouch, that hurts too. I can't. Ouch! Fucking steamy ouchiness. Piss off! Ouch! Fuck me! Go, go, get in the thing, go. Which way do I bloody go? Oh, it's a dead end. Hello. Which way do I bloody go? Is it dead? Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Run! Run! Oh my god! I know what I'm doing at this point. Huh? Did I just run out of a movie? That's totally fine. What's happening? What the fuck? Oh! Oh! Oh, I don't like this. Oh, God! I have no idea what I'm meant to be doing here, but I really am freaking out a little bit. What's this? Hang on, there's a thing missing. Oh! Hello? Oh, please don't make me cry. Oh, God. This 
This is a really unnerving game. Okay. I don't like crawling. Don't <laughs> make me crawl anymore. Ew. What is this? I don't want to know. Oh my god. This entire game is one big chasing scene. Oh, it's lovely. Come on. What is this that I'm standing on? Do I want to know? What is this? It's a rat. Oh! Leave it, Mr. Hardy. We're not that desperate yet. James! I said leave it! Oh no. I, why did I collect it? I don't want to collect a dead rat. Pain must be paid when one destroys the balance. A heavy cost. Ew. Come on. Okay, well, I guess we'll put the other rat on this. There you go. All lives are created equal. The life of one can outweigh the lives of many. That's one special rat. And that one's not dead! Oh no! Also, rats are lovely. Okay. Trust your Oh, instinct. that's really close to my ear. Come on. Oh! Instinct or reason. Instinct or reason. Oh instinct. God! Take, Take it or give up. Girl. Well, last time I, I think I got it right. Trust your instinct. Oh! Trust your instinct. Well, it's talking about being weak and whatnot, so I guess we're gonna take it. Basically choosing Worthless. things I wouldn't usually choose. Some things must be left behind. Some things. Oh, there's more here, look. Oh, is that I'm conf I'm so turned around right now. Long you ominous didn't hallway. Take it. You'll you'll starve. You let it go. You regret it. You gave up. You'll never make it. I thought I chose take it. Oh, bloody hell. What is this? Ah, is that Baymax? That likes eating apples. Or oh, is that a baddie? Oh, God. Explain why we see a lot of apples everywhere. Oh, oh. If she once saw this boy drown a baby rat in the gutter. She held the boy's head in the gutter till he promised to never do it again. 
There's always someone stronger than you. Oh my goodness. Hang on, there's a lot of places we can go here. Right, okay, there's a lot of different choices we can make here, so I think I might have to end this episode here if that's okay, because I don't know... Okay, good, right, fine. We might have to explore this next episode because there's a lot going on and I have no idea which direction to take and I have no idea where this is going to lead but it's going a bit, oh my god. <laughs> it's getting darker and darker and scarier and scarier. It's definitely scarier than the first layer of fear and that was pretty bloody scary. <laughs> All right, Fluffies, well, we'll pick this up again in the next episode. This is a fantastic game so far, but, oh, it's really giving me goosebumps. I mean, I knew it wasn't going to be a lovely Fluffy game, but I just didn't think it'd be this dark. <laughs> Please let me know in the comments below what your theories are on the story so far. I mean, assuming you don't know what the story is already, like you haven't played it or seen a play for already, because I don't want there to be spoilers there, but I'm really curious to know what you all think is happening so far. All right, well, thanks everyone so much for watching. Until the next video, awesome possum. Bye, Fluffies!